Hello you guys, this is Amano21 and tonight we're gonna take a look at the Binding of Isaac Rebirth for the PS4. The Binding of Isaac Rebirth, commonly referred to as Rebirth, is a remake of the original Flash game, The Binding of Isaac. This game was developed by Edmund McMillan and it released on November the 4th for on Steam, PlayStation 4 and PlayStation Vita. Now, this game features new non-flash based engine and it has the same design as the original but with brand new 16-bit pixel graphics the game also includes some additional content on the size of the Wrath of the Lamb expansion as well as some things that had to be cut out of the original game due to limitations of flash now as you can see he have a selection of characters that you pick from also take a look here it tells us that your basics how to move attack how to place a bomb and an item except that to place a bomb you press R1 it doesn't say that right there and look at this you just go through dungeons after dungeon until you beat this the game changes all the time so make sure you are ready for this because you're never gonna be playing through the same thing this game constantly changes it challenges you in every possible way and as for your method of attack you have your tears as you can see also if you walk into those golden doors like I did you will get power-ups like this I got a new mask sometimes they contain power-up sometimes they don't and throughout the game we're gonna fight various enemies like this guy right here which is shooting acid at me now some more some enemies are weak some enemies are strong some do more damage than others some you some you can destroy with ease also to move out of a dungeon you need to defeat every enemy in the dungeon what the hell can I kill that spider oh I think I'm realizing one thing the spider head it probably lets me control the spiders so let's move out of here anyway back to the review see among the enemies you will, you will also get exploding guys like this you have to shoot your way through piles of shit Also throughout the game by completing special feats you will unlock other characters that you can play as. They all have different abilities. So get ready to replay the game because like I mentioned there will be no repetition. It is rare if you get to do the same thing twice. Oh shit. Also you have an unlimited amount of continues. And watch, it's not gonna be the same again. Bam, different. So you'll never get bored with this game. Be, this game is like pretty good. But as of the month of November 2014, it's free to download if you're a member of uh, if you're a premium member of PlayStation of PS of PlayStation Plus. I'm sorry. And just look at this. You're just gonna be tearing through shit. Also, you. If you want to get this on Steam on the beta, it's $14.99 if, if you live in the US. And this game is cross by from PS4 to beta, so if you got it for free on the PS Plus for your PS4, then you can go on. Then you can go and download the beta version as well for free. Also, there is a feature that lets you transfer your save game from your PS4 to your Vita. So, if you make it far here and then let's say you have to go on a trip, you can just transfer your data. And look at this, we got a new mask. And, it, and it's a steel mask, hopefully it gives me more defense. And along the way you're gonna see stores like this, I don't have any money right now. So, buying the ladder or a key is useless so I'm gonna keep moving okay you guys 
like I was saying, see this guy has the the health of a boss, but look at this, I'm causing a lot of damage. Hopefully it's because of the mess. Oh shit! Shooting laser. Oh come on. Look at this, look at this. This guy's going all out. Look at this. He opens his chest and shoots a laser. I mean, who does that? Oh damn, you gotta avoid all of this. Oh shit. Oh shit, 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 shit. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Ooh, hearts. And a key. I mean... Should you buy this game? Should you skip on it? I'd say... Yes. You buy it. And... No. Do not skip on this. Also, a little update, you guys. I did make a video earlier about future PS4 games on the PlayStation on the Instant Game Collection. So make sure you make sure you um take a little peek at that video. Um, that video will explain to you what what's gonna come up in the future on PSN Plus. But as of right now, all I can say is it's good. December and January are pretty are gonna be pretty good games. They're gonna bring pretty awesome games. But anyway, let's just get back and fight this guy called Gemini. So I can take him. I'll try to beat him. He's the boss right now. If I beat him, I go to the second stage. And trust me. Ooh, I think I can do this. I think I can. Come on, this guy's just follow me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn, this guy's getting faster and faster, so he's, like he's getting damaged. What is it with this guy? The more damage he takes, the faster. Ah! Only one heart left. Come on, come on, come on. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm going here. Wait, come on, come on. We're both so close. We're both so close. Go, go, go. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Stop moving. Oh, you bastard. Well, anyway. I'm going to give it another go. At least try to get past the first stage. And as you can see, if I make it to the boss, it's not going to be the same guy. The game just switches and switches. I mean, that's one thing you gotta love about this game, the mindset of my side, that it's not repetitive. And you're not gonna get bored. And, oh shit. Let's take this. Also, among the various power-ups that I have found in this game, there was uh, one that allowed me to shoot gold tears. That power up was awesome, and they were shooting at high speed, and I screwed it up and I lost. Trust me, I've been trying my hardest. Like, when I heard this game was coming out on, on PlayStation Plus, I knew I had to give it a go. And, oh, jeez, a bonus area. Okay, this is the time to use a bomb, so where should we place it? Okay, how about, yeah. Oh fuck, it didn't blow up the coins thing, but it did the heart. Oh fuck. Anyway, I have a steel heart. How the hell did I... Oh well. Let's get that bomb. Got it. Oh fuck, I can't grab that. Okay, so we have another shop. I don't have enough money to buy anything, even if I grab those coins and... Nice, red shit. Okay. See what I mean? Different bosses. It's never the same thing here. And whoa, the worms. There's two. All right, let's try to beat this. Trust me, guys. If I can't get past this first stage on this review, then I will consider myself as a bad binding of Isaac player. So let's try not to suck and beat this. Alright, come on you motherfuckers, come on, come on. One of them is almost gone, come on, come on. All we gotta do is get rid of one, and the other one should be a piece of cake. God damn it, they keep taking the shit and blocking me. No fair. They use their shit to block you. Alright, go. 
One down, one down. Come on, we gotta beat this. We gotta beat this. Come on, come on. I'm down to my last heart, it's like last time. Trust me, I will be pissed if I fuck this up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, you little son of a bitch. Come on, come on. Back here. Got him. Get him. Well, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. And um, this, this was your boy, Samondo21, with you. And I will see you in the next one, my friends. So I'm going to leave this little cutscene for you guys. And peace out.